Well, here we go. Got her all done and in the door, the spring, the tracks, the motor, all of it. So, there's a touch pad here. Pretty squeaky, I don't know. It's, uh, I don't know, I think it's pretty cheap. I oiled all the little rollers and I oiled the uh, main drive unit up top in there. All that up in there where the cables run. Uh, ended up having to do a little patch job there on the wood. So yeah, it's all in, runs. I'm pretty surprised how easy they, it all was actually. it's. A lot easier than I remember. Uh, what was this? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's all wireless, the like that outside pad and everything. So Yeah, so I don't know what else to show, except for that it is uh, all done and working good enough anyway. Keep people from stealing from us, hopefully. And then hopefully I'll get all this together and make a, a video of... Uh, Also came with funny nowadays. They only come with one remote, so I got that. Oh, I thought I had it. It's not even blinking now. Batteries, probably. Oh, there we go. So yeah, all works. I don't know what else anybody could want to see. Or like I say, really simple compared to the old days. You wire in, first things first, you wire in that control pad to the motor. <clears throat> and then you wire in the sensors. Um, yeah, and when that outside thing, it just does it by like Wi-Fi almost, I guess, or something. So, wirelessly anyway, like pretty neat stuff, pretty simple. That spring, in the old days, you used to have to loosen those rods take two bars and manually crank it up and tighten it up and it was just a nightmare these ones now then very simple it, you put the you know I put like uh, my air gun on there did it the amount of turns they said you just count the, the whatever the that's all one line across like how the light streak there is and then as you tighten it up, then the curls come in. So, it's pretty neat. So, yeah. That's our uh, garage door. Thanks. See ya.